Let's get into some weird Let's get into some weird news. Do not obey. What's up, guys? It's me, Do Not Obey, and let's get into some weird news. Now, researchers discovered a nuclear reactor now back in the 1970s, I believe. Now, this was in Africa. Now, it was said that it was, I think, 1.8 million years old. Now, this French man that uh, he dealt with uranium, he was a researcher. Now he was working where a former French colony, colony was at at some time, right? Now where he had moved, where he started digging over in West Africa, he came across this picture that you're seeing behind me. Now, archaeologists found a 3,000-year-old bronze age sword, or sword, however, however you guys want to say it. Now, this was off the island of Denmark. Now, the sword is described as completely unique because it's still intact, for one, and it's about 1.3 uh, kilograms. The uh, blade is still intact, and it says that it's made from wood horn and of a tack winding material. Now, back in 2009, Mr. Copeland and about 1,500 other people had like a small little meeting about uh, UFOs. Now, this was in a, t a small town in England. Now, Copeland explained in 2005 that he had seen a triangular uh, craft in the sky while he was shopping. Now, what's strange is that in 2007, he photographs a craft from his apartment building, which I believe I have the pictures I'm going to throw behind here. Now, it is said also that he's seen balls of light like it sort of like orbs and it wasn't really moving one was solid white now there was a second orb also that he uh sees in this picture and it's across the street about 300 feet from the ground and he said it was changing very fast odd colors right now copeland posted the pictures online soon after he did receive a knock on the door now a strange man said that he was military and that he was a contractor and he was questioned deeply. Now for more of the story, um, you can go to the credit in the title. I have that sitting there, so let's go. Now, archaeologists discovered an old locked wooden box out in the woods. Now, the items inside date back to the Nazi era. How do you know this, Chelsea? Because they found currency that dated between 1924 and 1948, right? They also found an identification card that identified the man to the Nazi party. Now, also newspaper clippings, shoes, clothing, boxes of cigars, all this is going to be going on behind me. Also, uh, Jamaican rum um id tags and everything was just kept well it was like basically an amazing time capsule All right, guys, well, I hope you enjoyed Weird News. Hope you guys are staying safe out there. And like I always say, guys, do not obey. Stay woke. Peace.